Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of execution. Also, be sure to turn off the water to your dishwasher. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the leveling leg in a Bosch dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair. Should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For the job point, you need a 5 8 open end wrench, 5 16 inch nut driver, and a Phillips screwdriver. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new leveling leg. There is one rear leveling leg in this dishwasher that is screwed into the base and is used, yes, you guessed correctly, for leveling the dishwasher. The main reason why the rear leveling leg would need to be replaced is if it's stripped or cracked broken. To get the part, we need to open the door. We need to take out a couple of Phillips screws that hold the dishwasher to the countertop. And that's right there, and one in the corner on the left and one on the corner on the right. Using a Phillips screwdriver, I'm going to take it out. Put the towel in the plastic container under the shadow valve, just in case of the water will leak down. And then using the 5 8 open-ended wrench, take off the water line. Then using the 5 16 inch nut driver, loosen up the hose clamp and remove the drain hose from the air gap. Be careful, there is still some water inside the hose. Use the container or the towel. Okay, let's uh, pull it out. Now we're gonna tilt it up and I'm gonna jam it under the counter. And I'm gonna take out a couple of Phillips screws here in the corners and uh, remove the top panel. All right, I'm gonna put it on the feet and uh, pull a little bit more out and we're gonna place it on the left side carefully. So we can work from, from this side. All right, this is the leg, that the rear leg we're gonna take out. I'm gonna unscrew it, turning it counterclockwise and take it out. This is the old leveling leg next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from appliancepartspros.com. And now the new leg goes in. I'm gonna screw it in, turning it clockwise this time. And I'm gonna leave it the same level that the, the old one was. All right, now I can put it upright. And I'm gonna put the top panel on. Placing it on. I'm gonna match the holes. And put a couple of screws here. That's the uh, Phillips screws. I'm not gonna place the dishwasher down and reinstall it under the counter. Let's manually thread on the water line onto the shadow valve and tighten it using 5 8 open ended wrench. And then we can take out the towel and the container. Connect the drain hose to the air gap and tighten the clamp with the 5 16 inch nut driver. And now I'm going to secure the dishwasher to the countertop with a uh, couple of Phillips screws. And now we can close the door. Turn the water on, plug the dishwasher in, and run it to check for leaks. Hopefully there is none. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram. 